In this video, I'm going to show you how to split a volume in half and then, a ro and then rotate a portion of it. Uh, I'll start with this cube volume, and what I'm going to do is make a line across the top from midpoint to midpoint, and I will use the wire cut tool. Select cutting curve, that will be the line that I just made. Select objects to cut, select the volume, press enter, first cut depth. I'm just going to drag the line so it basically cuts all the way through the volume. And I want to make sure that it keeps both sides of the object that I'm cutting through. So if you type in K, you should see that where it says keep all here, it should be yes. And basically, I don't want to give any depth to this to this uh, wire cut. I want to make it a width of zero. So I'm going to input zero as it's asking for the second cut depth point. Right? And as you can see, it has made two separate objects. All right, now the second part of this is to use the rotate tool, uh, the rotate command, R-O-T-A-T-E. Click on the object, press enter. Now, there is a Rotate 3D, but technically I don't need that functionality for this. I'm going to rotate by 30 degrees by snapping on one point. Okay. If you use the 3D um, rotate, you would need to pick two points along an axis. And since I'm just rotating about a single axis that runs in the Z, um, along the Z axis, I don't need to select the two points. 